What's up, everybody? We're one week out. One week from the Olympia. This is what I've been training for for a while. This week's vlog is going to be a little bit different, and I hope you guys don't mind. I was trying to think of what's the best way to get across the message that I want to get across this week, which is simply, I want to motivate you. I want to inspire you. I want to show you that no matter what your age, what your height, what your weight, where your starting point is, where you hope your end point is, you, you can get it done. You can get it done. Just like I'm getting it done right now. So this week is a lot more training than usual. I'm gonna give you more tips about training than usual, more tips about your diet than usual. And I hope you guys are just inspired by what you see and the transformation. If you go back to my videos, even three weeks ago, you're gonna see a huge difference in my physique. Diet, supplements, training, 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 proper sleep. Hope you guys enjoy what you see. Ridiculously awesome week we have this week. Uh, today, we're just under three weeks left before the Olympia. So I'm super excited because you guys are gonna see a massive transformation over the next three weeks. And I hope you guys are excited to be watching. Uh, current status, I'm at uh, 60 minutes of cardio each morning. Sometimes it's high intensity, so that's sprint intervals. 30 seconds on, 90 seconds off on a four incline. Uh, generally running around 10 miles an hour, uh, sometimes 11.5, somewhere in that window. Or I'll do low intensity, and that's on a 15 incline. I know it's more like this, but it feels more like this. Uh, 15 incline, 3.4 miles per hour for a full 60 minutes. Gets you sweating like mad, like I just finished. And yep, I won the one from the wet t-shirt contest, it's true. Uh, so anyway, big week this week. Hope you're excited to watch. And by the way, for anybody watching, trying to copy my cardio, copy my diet, I'm gonna give you guys a full day of eating this week as well. So you get to see I'm probably at around uh, 22, 2300 calories in a day. If you're copying me though, be very careful. You can't expect the same results. There's so many variables that go into it and I'm giving you two of them. Imagine an equation with five variables and I've given you one plus one. I don't know the next three variables and those are critical. I don't know your current body weight. I don't know your current exercise regime. I don't know how hard you train in the gym. I don't know what else is going on in your life. So you can't expect to get my results doing the exact same thing. It just doesn't work that way. Plus, super important, you're not on the same supplements as me. I take the full cupboard of Magnum supplements every single day and it makes a huge impact on my energy levels, on how hard I train, on how hard I sweat, on how well I sleep, how well I recover. These are critical things that will dramatically change your body. cardio in the morning. If you are sitting there contemplating how slow the clock is moving or how if I just break this down into five minute segments, I've only got four or five minute segments left. I'd like to give you an alternative, something to use your mind for while you're doing that cardio to amplify your results of the cardio and get you more out of your life every single day. Special little mind trick. Uh, mindset trick, if you will, uh, that I use every single day. So first and foremost, I want you to start by thinking of all the things you're grateful for and thankful for in life. I personally call it prayer. I'm thanking the one who gave it to me, but you can call it whatever you want. 
Be grateful, be thankful for all the things you should be grateful and thankful for. This is gonna put you in a very special spot in your mind and on your body that's much more relaxed, much more happier. Next, we're gonna think about all the things that are gonna make today exceptional. What, what can I do? How can I act? What are the, the activities I should take part in that are gonna make today an exceptional day? And those are what you're gonna focus on. Now use that time to focus on it and go do it. Be prepared to do it mentally, go through it. Picture yourself going through that day. You're gonna be very successful. I hope you enjoy. I've done cardio in my life, which is thousands. I think this one's a first. Not only is that soaked, but here's where it gets good. Also soaked all the way. So JJ went a little special psycho on me today. New routine. So important to have new routines regularly. Every four to five weeks is when we change it up. Keeps your body guessing. Change up the routines, change up the amount of reps, change out the sets, change out the types of exercises, change out the combos, change out the supersets. All very important things to keep your body guessing. Build muscle. And for me, it's about tearing up right now. So the reps, the reps were insane today. He had me doing quads, five giant supersets, three different exercises. Hack squat, leg extension, and leg press. Obscene amounts of reps. Obscene. Off to shoulders. Five big giant sets again. Arnie press, shoulder press, and then uh, dumbbell ladder raise. Oh, I can't think straight. Holy smokes, crazy! You are so mean. If you guys don't have a good coach, if you don't have a coach, if you aren't getting unbelievable results in the gym, please use my coach. Please use JJ. He will change your life. What's up everybody? 14 days out from today for the Olympia and I'm so psyched. For the first time ever, I'm gonna try taking drip dry 14 days out. This is gonna be the tightest, most ripped I've ever been. Woo We've all heard the saying, abs are made in the kitchen. I'd like to give a different spin on that. Abs are not made in the kitchen. Abs are revealed in the kitchen. That means your diet is everything if you want to see your abs. But if you want super sexy abs, you got to work them hard. This is an amazing routine that uh, my coach JJ put together for me. It is disgusting. This is only the second time I've ever tried it. So forgive me for not being awesome at it, but uh, I think you're going to like what you see. Let's do it.
What's up everybody? I'm competing against Riley and Lauren for the pill swallowing contest. I don't know what the leader was at right now, so I just went all the way to 40 pills. I'll put it on the screen what I'm taking. Oh, oh, oh. Ah. My invisible line doesn't make me sound like I'm 16, does it? Oh my goodness, are these workouts amazing. Uh, to update you, I'm at 60 minutes of cardio each morning. I'm splitting that 30 minutes of incline walk, that's on the 15 incline, 3.4 miles per hour for 30 minutes. Great warm up, soaking wet already. That's 30 seconds of sprint between 11 and 12 miles per hour for 30 seconds, 90 seconds walk and it's on a four incline. It's awesome. I'm soaked every morning. And then I come and I freaking get destroyed in here. I feel so good. I have so much energy. Uh, 2,200 calories is what we're at right now. That's pretty low for me. Uh, but holy smokes, my body's responding well. Everything feels good. Cuts coming in every day. You gotta know, you gotta know your body. I've been getting asked a lot. Marcus, what is your split for workouts? I change up my splits consistently. Oh, first of all, I want to say uh, Oliver Nielakainen. Oh, I hope I got that right. Uh, he was the one who asked on my last YouTube video, but I've also received that same message on Instagram a lot lately. So I want to recommend to you guys, you got to change up your split constantly, constantly. So sometimes I'm doing chest with back like I did today. Other times it's chest with quads. Other times it's shoulders with hams. Other times it's shoulders alone, arms alone. Changing it up keeps your body guessing. Worst thing you can do is do the same routines over and over and over, the same mixes, the same exercises. What happens is your body gets used to it. When your body gets used to something, it doesn't need to change. I keep my body guessing so it's constantly going, oh my goodness, we need more muscle. We need more muscle or else we can't do this. And that's what I like. My first workout on hard muscle builder. <laughs> so excited. My Gymshark order arrived. 
Uh, I'm going to find out what all the fuss is all about. The David Lades and the Steve Cooks of the world and the RC Athletics Ryan Casey. Oh my goodness. Uh, I'll admit, I am not someone who puts my toe in the pool. You can see by the $600 worth of Gymshark, it's exactly what I've done here. And this looks like actually really nice stuff. Oh, baby. I'll do a full proper review on all this stuff over the next little bit in my videos. Very excited about my new Gymshark gear. There's my pre-cardio cocktail of goodies. Carnadium, heat accelerated, the new hard muscle builder, some DNA, some afterburner, because I really like to be sweaty and warm, main brain, rocket science. In here, high five, opus. It's gonna be a great day. Huge shout out to Gymshark. Really impressed with the quality of their clothes and the fit. Uh, while this one is pretty to touch on the tight side, uh, love, love, love these workout clothes. This is my official Gymshark review. I got a huge package of Gymshark goodies yesterday and I went for a hardcore cardio run this morning. Here's what I was excited about. Uh, first of all, I'm super picky about clothes. Super picky when it comes to gym clothes. I used to be hardcore Nike. They made some changes. I have nothing Nike. Uh, I was Under Armour. Hardcore Under Armour. They made some changes. I was lost. Uh, I've got some Lulu. I've got some Under Armour still. My old stuff. So I'm trying Gymshark out. Uh, I was skeptical about the material. It didn't feel like it was gonna hold fluids, but as you can see, it does really well with holding fluids. Uh, it was awesomely breathable, uh, felt great in it, and uh, the cuts are unreal. So Gymshark, way to go. Seven days. Seven days. One week to go. Seven days today. I gotta tell you, I could not be feeling any better. Uh, I just get absolutely drenched every single workout. I'm doing sprints five days a week now. Uh, one hour on a four incline, uh, 30 second sprint, 90 second walk. And it's just unbelievable. That patch is only because of the belt. Diet is awesome, diet is on point. We're at 2,200 calories per day. And uh, frick, I'm loving life every single day. New lines coming in. Uh, can't wait for the Olympia. The Olympia is gonna be so insane. I'm gonna show you guys such a good time. <laughs> I just did the best cardio of my entire life. I'm two days out from my photo shoot. I want you to think about how many people in their last week doing cardio complain like crazy that they're struggling, they got low energy, they're low carbs, they're so depleted. I want you to think about what the difference is between them and me. Uh, it's not because, well, it's not just because I'm on the best supplements. That's, a, that's one reason. It's not just because I'm doing exactly what God has designed me to do. That's a good reason as well. But how many of us know the path God has lined up for us and we still fight it? It's all mindset. All mindset. I've been looking forward to this week for so long, making sure I was mentally ready for this one to go crazy on the treadmill, to go crazy on the weights. I know I'm gonna be low carb. I know I'm not gonna have as much fat on my body to give me that energy boost. It all has to start here. So first, just set your mind right. It's not gonna happen overnight. It's gonna take a process. I can help you with that process, but just get in that right mind space. When you find the mindset, your whole world's gonna change.
It's not just about workouts. It's not just about having a better body. It's about having better energy all day long. It's about seeing this world in a different light. It's about accepting success that you are designed to achieve. Your whole life's going to be better. Let me help you get into that mindset.